Hey, it's April Cry, and you're watching Stage Right Secrets. Hey guys, it's Raquel with Stage Right Secrets, and I am here with the lovely April Cry. What's going on? Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Now, your new single, Fireflies, is playing all over Radio Disney. Yes, Congratulations. Thank you so much. How has it been promoting it and all of that process? I'm sure oh it's super gosh. exciting. It's so exciting. Um, just the fact that it's on Radio Disney, and I used to listen to Radio Disney, and still do, all the time. So do I. So, <laughs> um, it's just it's just been so amazing yeah. to hear it. And what was like the radio promo, what, going into Radio Disney? because I saw that yes. you did that. Was it such a surreal moment? It was. I, I walked in um, with my team with me and my guitarist, and um, we didn't even know if we were going to be able to play Fireflies Live, so we just walked in. We're kind of like feeling everything out, and they were just so nice, and we ended up playing it live, um, and it was just such a great moment. That's amazing. Now, <laughs> Halloween was this past weekend. Did you yes. dress up? Or I did. What was your costume? Okay. Find all I out. was Sandy from Greece. Yes. Um, Could never go wrong I've been that. wanting to do it for a while, but it was actually a last-minute thing. I was like trying to find a costume that was like super easy and quick, but also like classic. Yeah. And so, yeah, I came feel up like, with Sandy. I feel like <laughs> ones that come up like last minute are always the best yeah. though, because you, you're not overthinking it. You totally are. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So let's talk about you growing up. Okay. Growing up, was there a specific moment when you realized this is what you want to do with your life? Um, I think growing up for me was, it was just music all the time. My dad is a musician, so I kind of, I grew up in the church with him. He was the worship leader there, so I was just always surrounded by music. My sister's a singer as well, so um, I, don't, I don't know if there was like a defining moment where I was like, this is what I want to do. I just kind of always knew that music, like I just... I don't want to do anything else. Music is just my thing. So it's meant to be. Yeah. <laughs> now, songwriting is super important to you. Do you have it a specific is. process you go through? Do you lock yourself in a place like this, in your bathroom? <laughs> I, Some yeah. people do that. You never know. Yes. Um, I mean, every time, honestly, is different. Going in, I do a lot of co-writing with people here in Nashville. So I'll go in, and I'll have, like, an idea ready and you know we might go with that idea or we might end up writing something totally different that I had no idea we were going to write. So I mean honestly that's what I love about songwriting. You just go in and you ha you don't know what's going to happen and it just kind of happens. Just creativity so I really enjoy it. What's it like going in with someone who you've never written with? I can only imagine that's I've, really intimidating yeah. and kind of scary. Yeah okay so <laughs> I do that all the time. I, I have rights that are set up and I have never met the people in my life and it's just you go in and you just kind of have to leave your inhibitions at the right. door and go in. If you're like scared to say an idea, you're not gonna you're it's not, not gonna, gonna come up. It. Yeah, so you just kind of have to be you. And um, if they laugh at you, it's fine. Then it comes <laughs> if you into laugh a at that, song, <laughs> a, number, a number one song, yeah. then, then it doesn't even matter. Exactly. You recently you recently covered Smoke Break and Hello Hello by Adele, which is oh her cover is unreal. You have to go watch it. Thank you. What's it like covering those songs? Um, I really enjoy doing covers because I love putting my own stamp on those kind right. of, kinds of songs, um, especially like Carrie Underwood is such a big influence of mine right. and Adele as well. Um, I heard Adele's song like the day before I actually covered it okay. and I was just like almost in tears, just it's like so this good. song, I can't even like, I'm in a really steady, great relationship, but hearing this song, I'm like, oh. Just ugly cry, like <laughs> yeah. Kardashian right. ugly cry face. Exactly. So I was like, I have to cover this song. Yes. So, and it's yeah. so good. Thank you. You, you have to watch it. Like Thank chills. You. Bills. Okay, so what's next for you? Um, right now, I am, I've been doing a lot of writing. Um, I am getting ready to release my EP. We don't have a date yet. Oh, but I I'm thought we were going to get some inside <laughs> scoop right now. I just got so excited. <laughs> but I'm super excited about it. There's just, there's been a lot of writing and soul searching and um, it's just, it's been a great experience so far and I can't wait to share these new songs with the world. Yay, and we can't wait to share everything and review it. And Thank you. Spread the word. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, thanks for watching. To stay updated with all things CMA Week, be sure to check out our website, Stage Right Secrets, all our social media. And if you want to just shamelessly plug in all of your social yes. media, go for it. <laughs> sure, you can find all of my social media outlets on my website, aprilcry.com. Thank you. Thanks.